Hi folks, g'day. Uh, today I'm quite excited to show you this 20 centimeter Moviel piece. This is a saucier, also known as a conical saucepan. And this is from the Moviel M-Cook series, so which is the stainless steel product line from Moviel. And once again, as with some of my other pans that, uh, that were featured on this channel, I bought it just for the purpose of making a YouTube video to show you guys. Um, but I will no longer need it after the video. So if you want to pick it up from me for yourself, um, you can have it for the price of uh, 90 euros, okay? So overall, it's in very, very good condition. Uh, inside, there are some very, very minor scratches that, uh, that are actually quite difficult to see. I think you can actually see here. Um, on the outside, uh, there are some light scratches from regular use, but nothing unexpected. Uh, the handle is in uh, beautiful condition and on the underside well there are some light scratches again as as expected so overall pretty good condition now the oh and one more thing about the um the pen itself the uh, physically it's uh, structurally it's in perfect condition the bottom is perfectly flat there's no warping uh, so it's it's perfectly uh, stable on your cooktop so now if you buy this pen new uh, the price is around 200 euros in most retailers and uh, first of all i gotta say that at least in my opinion that's not um, that great value for money because i really think for around for that price um, there are other choices in the market such as for example the Demela atlantis both the conical version and the uh, and the vertical side of saucepan, which I think uh, personally gives you uh, better value for money. Uh, but still, nevertheless, this is a really beautiful piece. The quality of the craftsmanship is very high, uh, especially at the base of this handle. So this is for really, this part here is really my favorite part of, uh, of the pan. And the handle itself, it's got this U-shaped, um, uh, uh, this this U-shape, I don't know what the word I'm looking for is, but anyway. And uh, for me, at least, it's a very comfortable handle to grab. Um, makes you know flipping the pan quite easy. And here, of course, you've got Moviel 1830 engraved. And on the side, very subtly, you have the word France engraved um, beside the base of the handle. So in the M Cook product range, you have a very good selection of stainless cookware. You know, it's best if you go to Movia website yourself and have a look at all the options available. Um, but they got skillets, saucier, saucepans, rondos, uh, saute pans, casserole, stock pots, uh, or you name it. So there are plenty of options to choose from. So now let's go through the specifications as we usually do. So this is a five ply construction um, and the thickness is 2.5 or 2.6 millimeters. So with the thickness, it's it's definitely not thin, but I also wouldn't call it thick. Um, there are other, of course, other manufacturers in the market that make their pans uh, thicker than 2.5 millimeters, uh, once again, such as the Atlantis. Now, I'm not sure what the arrangement of the five layers is. Obviously, it's got stainless steel on the inside and the outside, but um, in the middle, I'm not really sure if it's three layers of aluminium or if it's one layer of aluminium one layer of stainless steel and one layer of aluminium but just from looking at it i suspect it's three layers of aluminium although don't um, don't quote me on that the weight of the pan is 1.1 kilograms uh, which is not light but it's also not heavy um, you know in my hand this feels a bit lighter than i originally expected um, so I definitely wouldn't call this a heavy pan and this is the 20 centimeter model and the capacity is two liters so the diameter across the top here is actually 21 if you measure from edge to edge and on the bottom uh, the flat diameter uh, across like this is 13 centimeters okay so now let's talk about a couple of things that I don't like about the pen. And the first thing I don't like, uh, which is, which is, which applies also to basically all the Movial pieces, is the price. Okay, so I think the price is is really on the high end. And uh, and just keep in mind that when you buy a Movial piece, you are partly paying for the, uh, for the 
brand name and the history. So, uh, so if you pay two hundred euros for this piece, um, you know, I I think, I I just, I don't think you are getting, um, getting t that much value for your money. Okay, I think um, like I said, there are other options on the market that offer you better value, you know, for your dollar than 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 this particular brand. Uh, one more thing that I don't like is, um, well, I did mention that the craftsmanship is is really top quality, and it is. Um, but there is one thing that they could do better, I think, and that is the edges, uh, especially the top edge, and also to some extent the bottom edge of this of this room. So the edge is very very sharp and is very uncomfortable to to touch if you run your finger finger across it like that. And if you do it hard. You could not likely, but you could actually cut yourself. Um, so I think they, yeah, they could have done a better job. Maybe a little bit more attention to detail here. Um, you know, if they just use a grinder to just make the edge a little bit smoother to touch, they will make this pen well perfect. And um, lastly, I think this is going to be a quick video. Um, I just want to bring my Atlantis pen into the picture. So if we were to compare these two pans, so this is my 20 centimeter Demela Atlantis um, saucepan, vertical sided saucepan. If we were to compare these two pans, uh, like I said, uh, with the value proposition, I do think you get more bang for your buck, you get more value for your money by going with the Atlantis. Uh, and that also applies to the, um, the conical saucepan from the Atlantis, which is a fully cladded pan, and this is a disc bottom pan. So with this pan, I'm going to put the lid aside. Um, you get that thick 3.8 millimeter bottom with a cop with a two millimeter copper base, and if you go for the conical, fully cladded uh, saucepan from the Atlantis range, you get the you get a thickness of I think it's around 3.5 millimeters. So definitely thicker than the than the normal VLs. So in terms of what you get, you know, what you get physically, I do feel that you get more bang for your buck with the uh, with the Atlantis. And also on a personal per, uh, on a personal note, I do prefer the Atlantis. Uh, sorry, this design, this straight sided design. Uh, first of all, I'm not really a, too much of a sauce guy. I don't make sauce with whisk a lot, which is the intention of this design. And secondly. Uh, because this is a straight sided pan, you get more volume for the same diameter. So the volume here is three liters and compared to the volume here being two liters. Okay. And uh, just by the way, I, um, the lid from the Atlantis, it fits perfectly on the Movia. Okay. Well, not perfectly, perfectly, but the, let's say it's a 95% uh, perfect match. Uh, so that's another point. If you buy if you buy this pan, it comes without a lid. Okay, so that's two hundred euros without a lid, and if you want the lid, that's an extra fifty euros you have to pay. Okay, so well again, you know, um, that's why another reason why I say it's not the best value for your money. Okay, okay, so I hope you enjoy that quick look, and I will see you in the next video.